In the month of September, we had Jillian Chase as our personality of the month. And in October, we decided to head up to Ogle to interview Whitney Lawrence, a young engineer at the Ogle Operations. Whitney Lawrence is our personality of the month. Thanks for staying tuned. We're here with our personality of the month, Whitney Lawrence. Whitney, thank you for being our personality of the month. Um, you know, we're going to talk a little bit about you. Um, can you tell us a little bit about you, your age, um, where you grew up and stuff like that? My name is uh, Whitney Lawrence. I was born and raised in the Georgetown district all of my life. I've never been out of Georgetown really, living. Um, I am 21 years of age as, as of recent, um, in August. Okay. Yeah, um, basically, yeah, that, that's it. Okay. okay, so um, what is your position here at the Rhino Group Companies? Currently, I'm a grade 3 technician, but uh, of recently, I have received my engineering license, and from there on, I should become a grade 1 okay. technician within the company, by, by company standards, of course. Okay, so how long has it taken you to reach from starting at Orima? How long did you start at Orima, actually? I actually started at Orima in 2015, actually. Okay. Yeah. And then you worked your way up? Yeah, basically, I started as a flight ops assistant, then after which I, uh, I entered into stores, in the stores department within the AMO. And then um, November of 2016, I went into the avionics department, which is my mainstream. Oh. Yeah, I entered there and from there I just continued pushing and I got my license uh, last month. Okay, so where do you see yourself in the aviation industry, especially in Guyana and with Mariah Mayna Home? We, we generally have to get type ratings after we have our um, engineering license, so for me it's just pushing to get my type ratings. But I gotta get my basics first, so I got my basic electrical aspect out of the way. Yeah. So I have to get radios, radar, the basics for those, and then from there move up to type ratings, where you buy that will give you certification to sign up these aircraft. Okay, so the, what I'm trying to understand, do you repair, um, repair or do you just do um, basic maintenance? Basic maintenance? We do something called preventative maintenance on the aircraft, yeah. where I, we do schedule inspections to make sure things are always working. If we find that they're not working or they're not working up to a standard, we replace them. Or we, carry, or we carry out an inspection and replace parts on the item of itself to put them back into service. Okay. Family life. Can you tell us a bit about your family life? Well, I got five sisters and one brother. Mm -hmm. They are a bundle of joy and misery at the same time, but I'm sure everyone knows that. It's family. They'll, they'll, give, they'll give you some rough times and some good, some really good times. Okay. Yeah, they just love them. They're, they're just a joy, in, joy to me. Okay, so um, let's get into a little more into what you do. Can you briefly explain, um, I don't know, it might be a little hard for us, for us to understand, but can you briefly explain what is it that you do? Basically, uh, well, I'm an electrical I'm in the electrical aspect right now. So basically an electrical system that is on the aircraft, mm -hmm. I would have the permission to check it, make sure that everything is, it is working. If anything is not, I can repair it, providing it's within what we call our scope of work, because if it's not, that would be legal and, well, I can be incriminated, or and I could actually make the company be incriminated as well. So, okay. Well, thank you very much, Mr. Lawrence, for the interview today. We do hope uh, to hear a lot more from you in the Rhino Group companies, and we hope that you um, that succeed in whatever you do in the future. And uh, we're looking forward to big things from you in, in the aviation industry in Yeah, thank you very much. Thank you for having me here today. And that has been our personality of the month.